What's up, YouTube? It's Jamin09. So I'm coming at you today with a quick video of War of the Giants Round 2. I have not done an opening on this, so I thought I'd pick one up and go ahead and do an opening. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. Looking to get, hopefully, a big eye or high priestess or something like that. Sorry the camera's shaking. I'm doing this on the table. It's not very nice, and I did not bring a knife to the opening. There we go. Oh. Oh. Okay. There we go. Sorry for the shaking, guys. I'm going to go ahead and pick this up and try to open it so I don't, like, make y'all nauseous. Uh, alright, so, I haven't done an opening like, on this one. I know that the big round two pack is glued, and you gotta love the glue. And then you get, I think it's six of these other packs, hoping for a card card D. That'd be awesome in these. Go ahead and get that up off of the side. Uh, I know y'all don't normally care about the these packs, so I'm gonna put off those off to the side. Go ahead and open the round two pack, because that's what everybody wants to see anyways. So we got Berserk Gorilla, Butter Spy Protection, Evil Swarm Mandagora, Winged Sage Falcos, Star Ray, and then here are the hollows so far. Hypnocorn, Shift, Different Dimension Gate. I didn't know that was in here. Share the Pain, Nordic Relic, Levi Levitane, Butterfly Yoke, and oh, there we go, number 11 Big Eye, Ultra Rare. That's exactly what everybody was looking for in these packs. Okay, cool. I like this pack. So, we got a big eye. Whoo, now I have two big eyes. It's awesome. Uh, I actually got one from a friend, and now I got this one basically for trade. So, I know everybody was looking for a big eye out of this, so pretty glad we pulled it. He kind of looks kind of good in Ultra Rare. I like him in Secret Rare, but he looks kind of good in Ultra Rare. So, I'm going to put that one up there. Put all our little supers down here, just because, you know, there won't, we won't get any more supers. Chthonium Blast, Invader of the Darkness, uh, Mogmol, and Majestic Majestic Mech Guy Goru. Garui? Go, I don't know. So, those are the commons. So let's go ahead and open up the battle packs now. Hopefully we can get maybe something good, like a god card. Haven't ever pulled a god card in these. And I don't know if I will now. <laughs> um, we got Ego Boost and Big Bang Shot. And then a Splendid Venus. Pitch Black Werewolf, which actually might not be a bad card because during your uh, during your opponent's or your opponent cannot activate trap cards during the battle phase. So if you keep him on the field, if you have ten keys and stuff to search him out, he's actually not that bad. Because then they can activate traps while he, during the battle phase. They can still uh, not during the battle phase. Half counter, rope of life, phantom dragon, eight fighter, and scapegoat. Scapegoat's pretty good. I like scapegoat. Let's see what else we got. Kind of, I'm, I'm still kind of excited about this uh, big guy up here. That was actually a really good pull. So we got Malevolent Nuzzler, Beast King Barbaros. It's actually not a bad card. Jirak Tyrant or Jirak Titano, Tardy Orc, and Rope of Life. We got double rope, rope of Life. Maybe I need to make make a deck around Rope of Life. No, it's a bad card. Mask of Weakness. Alright, so we got Mask of Weakness, Violon Prism, which actually is not a bad card, Graceful Charity, you gotta love it when you get a banned card, a uh, little wing guard, and then, oh, there we go. So we got Tang, Tangsnir of the Nordic Beast. Uh, there's no way I can say that. That's good, because I'm thinking about building a Nordic deck, so that's not a, uh, it's not a bad card to get. Two left. A really bad card that nobody should ever play. Horn of the Unicorn, because... If it said you get to choose when this card is sent from the field to the graveyard, you get to choose to return it to the top of the deck, that'd be good. But it's just return. So then there's another Tang near, or Tang's near, or whatever you want to call it. Hyper Ancient Shark Megalodon. You gotta love those cards. Uh, Death's Mosquito. Ooh, Plague Spreader. That's actually not a bad common. It's a really good card. And last pack. Can we get an Obelisk? Can we get a Winged Dragon of Raw? Can we get a Slifer? Probably not, but it will be awesome no matter what. Earthquake. And Tiki Soul. Which, I don't, it's just a, mm, it's not a bad in a Raya deck or something like that. Uh, Dark Magician of Chaos. Cool. It's actually not bad. Uh, Winged Rhinos and, oh, okay. I got a playset of these guys now. Sweet! What is he doing again? This guy just destroyed a battle special two tokens. Level three tokens. So basically you got, this got destroyed. And you can easily synchro into anything you want. Dark Magician Chaos. So quickly go through what we basically what we pulled from this set. 
of Battle Pack Round 2. We got Dark Magician Chaos. Plague Spreader Zombie, really good common. Violon Prisma, good, good common. Beast King Barbaros for the skill drain decks. Butterfly Yoke, Nordic Beast, Share the Pain, Different Dimension, Shift, Hypnocorn, and last but certainly not least, number 11, Big Eye. He's staring into your soul. Okay, um, basically, this is probably the best card you could pull out of everything. High Priestess is nice, but this is still better. And it's first edition. And it's first edition. Awesome. So, like, comment, subscribe, guys. Like, if you like the video, hit the like button. If you want to see more Yu-Gi-Oh! videos, Yu-Gi-Oh! openings, hit that subscribe button. Also, have another random video coming up of what I might be doing in the future. So, like, comment, subscribe, guys, and later.